So we all know Mills CNC for the sale and supply of machine tools around the UK and Europe. But today, the story is about a different area of the business. It's about CNC training. Welcome to the Training Academy. Um, and what we do is we provide training for Mills customers and for anybody else. So you don't have to be a Mills customer, you don't have to have a DM Solutions machine. If you want to learn how to set and operate a machine, if you want to learn how to program a Fanuca, Heidenheim or Siemens machine, then we can cater for your needs. So a customer can come to us and say, I want to get into the industry. Um, I know nobody will be interested in me unless I've got a little bit of experience. So what's the best course for me? We'll point them into the set or operator courses as a, as a ground level to get into the industry. What they do is they come here, they learn the basics. So that when they go back to work, they're useful and they have the skills and don't need somebody standing behind them all the time. So, you know, they can have a mentor at work, but they've got the, the baseline skills to be able to go and do that job with minimum supervision. And um, what's the classroom environment like? Because some people might think, gosh, I've got to go back into a class, you know, People would these days think they might be more inclined to go online and do things. Is that, what is it actually like here? So here uh, we, have, we have three classrooms. So we have an eight, we have a six, and we also have a three. Okay, and so yes, some people don't like this environment or the classroom environment. They feel, especially if there's people in there who uh, they don't know from different companies, from different backgrounds. And we understand that it's not everybody's perfect environment, but what we try to do is we try and make people feel comfortable. We explain that we understand that people, it isn't everybody's cup of tea. And we make sure that everybody understands what they're doing. We explain it. If you, if you tell us you don't understand or you're struggling, we will help you. You know, there's a great return on investment. What is that sort of time period that it really takes to get familiar with some quite high level programming. You know, is it a day, yeah. two days, three days? Could it be longer than that? What's the longest course? For you? Okay, so the longest course is obviously for our top of the range machines, our, our SMXs, where you need to be a proficient turner. So what we advise people to do is to do our five day turning course to start with. That will take you through the two axis, through to your C axis, through to your Y axis, through to your sub spindles. So you've got that as a good base. And then you come back for an extra three days to do the SMX, so that you're, you're rotating um, B axis. I would probably say um, over the year, it's probably 40% don't have our machines or haven't bought or are out in the field and have got a second hand machine maybe that we've been and done the training on. Um, but it can be, as long as you've got a Fanuc control, a Heidenheim control or a Siemens control, I'm hoping it's because Mills have a good name and the Training Academy um, has a good name. We read our, our reviews, if you, you know, we try to be helpful, but I try and answer all inquiries that come through the website, you know, sort of the same day. And I hope that because Mills have got a good name, the Training Academy have got a good name and we're very, very visible on social media, that that's how people find us. And my last point, uh, Karen, is uh, maintenance. So every machine tool needs maintenance and here, you're very well known for your training as we see behind us. Mm -hmm. But maintenance is an area as well that you are heavily involved in. Yes, we offer a maintenance training at Mills um, and we do mechanical and electrical. So two days on a mechanical course, two days on an electrical course, but they do sort of generally feed into each other. Um, I think maintenance is one of those areas that people don't always want to be on the phone to somebody on the help desk. If they've got somebody who's got a general knowledge of how to fix their machine quickly, it helps with production. And just the upkeep of the machine. Yes, we have service, yes, we have servicing who go out and, and service our machines and look after, you know, when we have major problems. But if it's something simple that somebody on site can t take care of, then that's why we offer the maintenance courses, which are really quite popular. <laughs>